one of the things that I don't know if you follow it, John, but uh, Mick Haley hit on a couple years ago was that the team that reaches 10 first tends to win 83% of the sets. And so our, one of our goals is we want to come out and get, jump all over you at the start of practice. We want to get out and we want to play every day right, right off the bat and try to get going. So, you know, if, if, the, if the team that reaches 10 first wins 83% of the sets, then we want to practice reaching 10 first. It's actually uh, interesting you said that. I hadn't heard that stat, but I, when I was coaching the Devon ladies a few years ago, we definitely had an issue with getting off the slow starts. And um, in the National League in England, they play with the 8 and 16-point technical timeouts. So I got yeah. to the point where I said, okay, we win the game to 8. We win, you know, we win the game to the first technical timeout. And, boy, did that change things. <laughs> you, know, you know what somebody said to me, and I never thought about it. I, I do a thing called the high five. we got five variables that we want in every single game. We want to reach 10 first. Because if the guy that reaches 10 first wins 83% of the sets, I want to be that guy. We want to force the first time out. We want to reach 20 first because that guy tends to win 92% of the sets. And we want to force the second time out. And then after 20, John, we just want to play clean. That doesn't mean you won't score. We just don't want to give you any points. And so I told somebody that, and he said, you know, that's a great idea. And he said, because now your kids, you've broken down 25 points into really – Five little games with them one, and people can play smaller games better than they can play larger games. And you know, I never thought of it. We just call it the high five, and we we chart how you know how many of those variables we nail down. But it's just like what you just said. You know, you're playing to the technical. You want to be the first to the first technical. You want to be the first to the second technical. And what happens is you you know in this day and age of people with really uh, fleeting kind of fleeting uh, comprehension and or attention spans, you, you may be better off putting things into segments where you're playing in 5, 10, 15-point segments as opposed to 25. 